How was Moscow? Kamarov is gone. I set him up as a Langley spy. It's quite the scandal at the FSB. His death will not be investigated. Your turn. Very well. The secrets of the global elite. Five years of work. Everything we've collected. This thing makes WikiLeaks look like a gossip rag. The pen beats the sword, huh? I have found that whoever wields the sword decides who holds the pen. Smile, Victor. Your reputation is safe. Now run along. I'm sure you have pretty dresses to attend to. Victor. Good luck with the show. I have a feeling it's going to be the one you'll be remembered for. Good morning, 47. Your destination is the coastal town of Sapienza, also known as the jewel of the Amalfi Coast. Your target is a former client of ours, Silvio Caruso, a brilliant but troubled bioengineer employed by the Ether Biotech Corporation. Renowned for his early stem cell research, Caruso is now reportedly working on a far more disturbing project, a DNA-specific virus able to infect anyone, anywhere in the world. Imagine a bullet, fired in any direction, passing through countless bodies without inflicting harm, invisible and undetectable until it strikes its target. A world of armchair assassins killing with impunity. This is what awaits us, unless Caruso is stopped. Our client, one of Ether's major private stockholders, wants the project cancelled on ethical grounds, but without destroying the company in the process. She has asked us to eliminate Silvio Caruso and destroy the yet unfinished virus prototype. You will also need to deal with Caruso's lab head, Francesca DeSantis, a high-level Ether employee and cutthroat corporate climber who holds intimate knowledge of Caruso's research and could potentially carry on in his place. This is no ordinary contract, 47. Caruso's virus is a serious threat to our craft and trade, not to mention our core ideals. So failure is not an option. I'll leave you to prepare. Welcome to Sapienza 47. Silvio Caruso's family home is right across the square. The bioengineer suffers from acute travel phobia, so the Ether Corporation has installed a state-of-the-art field laboratory somewhere below ground. Expect security levels to rise as you get closer to the virus. Good luck, 47. some pants on. Hey, talk nice to your sister. Look, I got you this job. So just do as I say or Chef Marcella will be angry at both of us. Oh, please. Like, you want to wait on that weirdo Caruso for the rest of your life? Come on, you gotta think big, sis. This, man, all this here is just temporary. Oh, blah, blah. Oh, 
Chef Marcello Ray has hired a new kitchen hand by recommendation, and the two have yet to meet. Could be a convenient way to infiltrate the mansion. FYI, according to our research, Chef Marcello has been trying to replicate Isabella Caruso's famous home cooking, but Silvio Caruso is not impressed. I suggest you give him a helping hand. Excuses, Rocco. Just like Dad. But I don't want to lose this job, and you promised me you were right. Intestines, cow, horse, do this for me. Whatever. Okay. You don't get it. I'll be right. Let me guess. Conservatives? Hey, sorry, pal. I voted for the other guy. Take a chance. Chef Marcello. I'm the new kitchen hand. Sorry, I'm late. You're damn right you are. <sighs> Never mind. Y uh, you can finish this tomato sauce. Maybe you can get it right. I seem to be jinxed. When you're done, ring the dinner bell. Sure thing, boss. I'll give it some love. Russo will be coming to lunch shortly. His last meal, I presume.
weird. Excuse me? What's up in the kitchen? You didn't tell me your cousin was back in town. Ah, do I detect a certain attraction to the dashing private detective from Milan? Oh, what of it? He's cute. Actually, uh, well, I really shouldn't tell you this, but he's here about a case. The client is Francesca DeSantis. You know, the, the female doctor that's staying at uh, Villa Caruso. Really? Wonder what she wants with a snoop. Well, y you didn't hear it from me, okay? Where'd you see him, anyway? Couple of streets over, sleeping on a bench. Yeah. Huh. Well, that's all for you. According to our research, Sal Falcone, a private investigator from Milan, has performed services for Silvio Caruso in the past. The question is, does Falcone still work for Caruso, or does DeSantis have an agenda of her own? Only one way to find out. Always was a Nighthawk. our research, Sal Falcone, a private investigator from Milan, has performed services for Silvio Caruso in the past. The question is, does Falcone still work for Caruso, or does DeSantis have an agenda of her own? Only one way to find out. Sexy voice. Good job, Chef. Those little hors d'oeuvres, so cute and tasty. Are you kidding? Pick a page out of the history books. No, oh, man, whatever they're doing over at Villa Caruso, got them scared. <laughs> hey, it's Sal. Well, now what did I tell you, Curly? Once a cheat, always a cheat. Trust me, Curly, there is nothing I would like to do more than follow your wife around town. Again. But, you know, I'm, I'm on a case, down in Sapienza. Uh, di didn't Marlena in reception tell you? Ah, Christ, you know, what do I pay her for? Anyway, uh, I gotta split, Curly. I'm waiting for an address here. Look, I'll give you word when, uh, when I get back, you know? We'll, we'll shoot some pool, get you back on your feet, all right?
Oh, Curly, you human punching bag. That is Francesca DeSantis. Good thinking, 47. Ah, this is one time off. the dame won't fool the detective. Out of place. So, uh, what's this about? Oh, walk with me. This is all too public for my tastes. Do you mind? This is far enough. Mr. Falcone, what I am about to ask you might be highly unorthodox. Go on. About a month ago, Silvio Caruso hired you for an acquisition job. I need to know what exactly it was you acquired and why. I'm afraid I can't do that. P.I. Confidentiality. I, I, I am willing to pay you handsomely. You could retire, hire others to dig through garbage. Don't think so. I like to get my hands dirty. <sighs> if you wanted to claim the moral high ground, you could have done so over the phone. Saved us both a trip. If you change your mind, you know where to find me. Target down. Next up, Silvio Caruso. I mean, how can a private company close down a city? More? An accident at the Ether Lab has claimed the life of a scientist. His body is currently stored at the town morgue, and a guilt ridden colleague plans to visit there to pay her respects. Between them, these two have everything we need to infiltrate the field lab.
I'm from the church. Can I go in? Hey, nice threads, buddy. Who are you, man? Do, do I know you? Under orders, not. Bless you, son. Can anyone please help me? Please help me. Entering the Ether Lab requires a key card and a uniform. Luckily, it seems both are within reach. This prototype will be close by. Look for some type of quarantine unit. What? Dude, you scare me. What did you just what'd you just do here? Look. I get a little intimidated by lab coats, you know.
Get how they get away. Forget about it. I'm not coming through here. Don't you have some toilets to scrub? Now beat it, son. You do know this. you down if you want to proceed. According to the medical journal, Caruso suffered a breakdown last year. He claims to have found his mother's favorite record playing in the empty dining hall and seen her chairlift move by itself. Upon hearing the service bell ring in Isabella's old bedroom, Caruso entered alone and was later found unconscious by his staff. He claims to have no recollection of what he witnessed inside. Now that is interesting. Salutations, houseboy. That is Silvio Caruso.
good show, 47. Now do put the poor soul out of his misery. Hello? Is anyone in here? <laughs> Two targets down. Now destroy the virus.
dead rat in my boat. Ah, good. And off. Sorry, buddy. I can't let you through. Rules are rules. See you, man.
control panel for the air purification system. We're at a critical stage of development. We keep the central lab perpetually doused in chemicals. In case of an outbreak. In case of an accident, the central lab unit is kept perpetually doused in chemicals to stop the virus prototype from spreading. Entering without a hazmat suit is sure to be lethal. The air purification system is able to clear the toxin, but the controls are only operated by senior lab personnel. Complete. Now head towards an exit. Oh, so I'm gonna talk. Yeah. Anything else loose on that? 